Did you know the holiday season can make or break real estate deals? Whether you're investing, buying, or selling, the festive season in Hilton Head Island and Bluffton, South Carolina holds unique opportunities you can't afford to miss. Let's dive in. Today we're going to talk about a topic that could save or make you money. How the holiday season impacts real estate market in Hilton Head Island and Bluffton, South Carolina. Whether you're a seasoned real estate investor or just dipping your toes into the market, this time of year presents unique opportunities and challenges that you won't want to miss. Let's talk about four ways the holidays can shape our local market and how you can leverage these trends to your advantage. Point one, slower market equals more negotiation power. Let's start with a major advantage of the holiday season, the slower market. Traditionally, this time of year sees fewer buyers actively searching for properties. Think about it, people are busy with travel plans, family gatherings, and holiday shopping. For you as an investor, this translates into significantly less competition. But there's more. Sellers who choose to list their properties during the holidays are often doing so because they need to sell. They might be relocating for a job, downsizing, or dealing with other life changes. This makes, this makes them more open to negotiation. For investors, it's a golden opportunity to secure properties below market value. It's also an excellent time to make offers on properties that have been sitting on the market for a while. The pressure of year-end deadlines often encourages sellers to accept reasonable offers rather than hold out for something better. Point number two, increased emotional buying. Now, let's talk about something we don't always associate with real estate, emotions. <laughs> the holidays bring out feelings of nostalgia, warmth, and family. When buyers step into a beautifully staged home that smells like fresh pine and cookies, they're not just thinking about square footage or price per square foot, they're imagining their family gathering around the fireplace or hosting holiday dinners in the dining room. As an investor, you can use this to your advantage in two ways. If you're selling, work with your agent to stage your property with subtle holiday decor. Subtle holiday decor. Think string lights, warm blankets, and festive table settings. A little goes a long way. If you're buying, understand that emotions can sometimes cloud a buyer's judgment. This creates opportunities to close deals quickly before other buyers start second-guessing themselves. Emotional buying isn't just for primary homes, either. Vacation homes and rental properties can also evoke these feelings, making them attractive to buyers looking for a cozy retreat for a holiday or a simple getaway. Point number three, tax advantages for year-end closing. Let's talk about numbers. If you're an investor, the holiday season is more than just an opportunity for good deals. It's a chance to maximize your tax benefits. Closing on a property before December 31st can provide several advantages. For example, 1031 exchanges. If you're selling an investment property and buying another, you can defer capital gains taxes by completing the transaction before the end of the year. Deductions, mortgage interest, Property taxes and closing costs can all be deducted this year if you finalize the deal in December. This is where strategy becomes key. Partner with your financial advisor or CPA to identify opportunities to reduce your taxable income through smart real estate decisions. Point number four, vacation home market heats up. Finally, let's discuss vacation properties only. Hilton Head Island and Bluffton are among the most sought after, sought after vacation destinations on the East Coast because we have amazing beaches. <laughs> During the holidays, families look to these areas to escape the cold, enjoy the beaches, and celebrate in luxury. For investors, the seasonal surge in visitors means one thing, opportunity, rental, potential. If you're investing in short-term rental properties, the holidays can be one of the most lucrative times of the year. Highlight the property's ability to generate income through platforms like Airbnb and VRBO, Many holiday visitors fall in love with the area and decide to purchase their own vacation homes. Getting it to the market now means you'll be positioned ahead of the spring rush when demand spikes again. Hilton and Island and Bluffton properties aren't just beautiful, they're smart investments that offer steady appreciation and strong rental demand. Okay, that's my take on the market. Here are the numbers. Starting with single family homes. There are currently 1,177 homes active on the market with an average days on market of 105 days. 49 of those are new in the last seven days. That's down. 770 are under contract. 51 have been sold in the last seven days with an average days on market of 47 days. The average sold price was $737,097. Now the condo market. There are 370 condos active on the market with an average days on market of 118 days. 
10 of those have been in the last seven days. 101 are currently on a contract. 12 have been sold in the last seven days with an average days on market of 83 days. The average sold price was $594,750. The holiday season might be winding down, but real estate opportunities are just heating up. Whether you're looking to invest in Hilton Head Island or Bluffton or the surrounding areas, the time to act is now. If you or someone you know needs help buying or selling, use my work with me link in the description and let's get started. And of course, feel free to leave any questions in the comments below. I'd love to hear your opinion. And as always, have a great rest of your day, have a great weekend, and I will see you next week.